Over the last 30 years, the AIDS epidemic has devastated the continent of Africa. In Uganda, all are either infected or affected by AIDS. According to UNAIDS GAP report 2016, over 1.5 million people are living with AIDS. Among adults, 7 in 100 are likely to have HIV AIDS. 83,000 new infections were registered in 2015 and over 28,000 AIDS-related cases are registered annually in Uganda. Sadly, only 57% of the HIV-infected adults have access to antiretroviral drugs, a drug that suppresses the growth of the virus and consequently increases the life expectancy. This sad phenomenon leaves devastation poverty, and death in its wake, the most affected by this epidemic being children. Crane is Children at Risk Action Network, and it's a network of 120 organizations that work with vulnerable children, children on the street, children in residential areas, children who are orphaned or children who are neglected. Child abuse and child protection is one of our objectives to make sure that we talk to people and make them aware about those and therefore in that aspect and objective we talk about HIV AIDS because HIV AIDS makes children vulnerable. Children need to be fought for, need to be protected, need to be advocated for. Uganda was doing this in the 90s and uh, they were working hard in campaigning against HIV AIDS and new infections. The current HIV prevalence in Uganda is alarming. Um, people, especially young people, seem to have taken their conscience of HIV AIDS. They seem to have forgotten the fatality of HIV AIDS. They seem to have forgotten, um, you know, what we went through fighting HIV AIDS and, and, and creating awareness. HIV AIDS exists. HIV AIDS is killing people in our society. It is even more worrying that it is killing particularly the people that are married. It is secretly, slowly but surely killing many because many have chosen to wear a mask to keep themselves clean in society. Today when you look at life, especially in the lives of young people, sex is like a game. Because families are no longer there, parents are no longer there for their children. HIV in Uganda would say is something that is existing, killing, and destroying several lives and families. It's true, HIV is still a danger to society, to all of us, to you and me. So we're appealing to all you young people and all, uh, all you adults in any way that you can, please, let's try to fight the cause and stay alive. Because life is the ultimate gift we have from the Almighty God. It's important for us not to let the candle burn down, the candle that was lit by our you know, predecessors, the likes of Fidel Taya. We should know that AIDS is still present among us, is still spreading at an alarming rate. It still kills. Crane is coming to ask the public to join us again so that we can continue being champions against HIV AIDS, to reduce the new infection rates, to make sure that children are protected from being stigmatized, uh, to make sure that young people are more careful about their sexual activity, but also to pass on this message to the community, to the parents, that they need to be good role models on how they behave sexually because that is one of the major ways HIV AIDS is uh, passed on. It is important for a young person to wait for marriage, to abstain until marriage, and also I would encourage them to look at themselves and see what do I bring in this life. The people that are struggling to live positively, I applaud them. Um, in my own analysis, they are the people that have uh, uh, kept the candle burning, but they need the support of the entire society. Um, we need to completely eliminate the stigma 
to know that AIDS, HIV AIDS is part of us, it's in our society. I believe that we ought to respond to HIV AIDS because of the trickle down effects on the family. The children have been left suffering. Wives have been left suffering. Husbands have been left in confusion because we have kept silent at HIV AIDS. So let's be alive, let's keep alive. Let's protect one another, let's respect each other's families, friends, girlfriends, boyfriends. It's only through protection, when you protect yourself, that you can show real care for your partner, you know? Let's rekindle our fight and energy and investment against HIV AIDS because HIV AIDS is still a problem and still kills. AIDS is a problem for the whole world and is still having grip on life. Please wake up. Remember my friend that AIDS is still around and AIDS still kills. Wake up. Wake up, AIDS still kills. The safer you are, the better. HIV is real and it kills. It really does. HIV AIDS kills. Let's respond. It's your life and it's important to you and all of us because where would, where would I be if I didn't have friends like you, fans like you people? I want you alive because I also enjoy more when I entertain you guys. So stay alive, protect yourself. So peace and love to all of you. God bless you, God bless you, and God bless you so much. Thank you.